All right. Well, I'm um, sorry. Ignore this twerking Aaron that I drew. I'm just gonna make a new one. Okay. <laughs> you didn't see that. <laughs> All right. So this is called Ask Jabe. Yeah. So while I answer questions, I am going to doodle. Yeah. And by doodle, I mean doodle as an actual doodling, which means do not expect anything extravagant. <laughs> I'm probably going to find something on the internet like this and sketch it out just for the heck of it. I'm so proud of this. So. <laughs> First question. Chappy, do you eat mushrooms with ants and the moon in it and poison dust and a ton of... Wow, that's a lot of W's. That eat you back if you eat them and then... This question. I... I don't... know. Nice question, though. Next. <laughs> Jackie? Oh, yeah, that was asked by Aurora Nightcat. Next, Jackie, John Jackie Johnson asks, Did you learn how to draw on your own, or did you watch a tutorial or something like that? Well, yeah, I, yeah, kind of. I did kind of learn how to draw on my own, and I kind of didn't. Like, I first started drawing on my own, mainly, well, wow, this is hard. <laughs> Thanks for making me think. More questions like this. Um, I really, it was kind of a bit of both. I looked for, I, this is a hard question. I, I started off by taking pictures from the internet and just drawing them like I did this one. I was looking at a picture and I sketched it out and that's what turned out. And it looks a lot like the picture. Just a few changes. And after that, I did take an art class and there were like only a few things that I learned that really helped me along the way. I didn't really learn that much. Then... After that, I discovered Finch Wing. Ooh. And I wanted to draw more like her. So I did look at a few tutorials on how to draw cats and stuff like that. But I didn't really do that much tutorial watching. But sometimes, occasionally, I will go back on YouTube and look at different tutorials of how to draw this and that and blah blah blah. But, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> that was a good question. But, if you're wondering what it takes to learn to draw, because a lot of people want to know. God, thanks for the question. It took me a while to learn how to draw, basically. I had been drawing my whole life, but when I really started getting into it, that's like around 6th grade. Going to 10th grade now, so that's... Like four or five years yes I counted um I recommend if you're just starting out look on the internet for tutorials and different things on how to draw this if you want to know how to draw it's first things first look for the anatomy of something that's what I recommend next question do you like waffles? Do you like pancakes?
do you like French toast? Da 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 da, can't wait to get a mouthful. I like them, well, yeah, I like them all. Asked by Teresa the Rogue. I'm gonna pause this for a second. Alright, I'm back from the, I mean, not from the dead, no. I am back ish. Somewhat. So, Teresa the Rogue asked again, do you like jam tarts what are jam tarts that's what I want to know they sound yummy I like the word tart mmm tart I like lemon tarts but I don't know what a jam tart is I'd like to try one why don't you make me one alright everybody make me a jam tart make it snappy snappy jappy yeah Alright, the next question. Or, wow, questions. By Akira the Wolf. Um, do you like this community? For the people on my YouTube who do not know what she's talking about, excuse me, I'm part of a community called the Warriors Community. And, I like it a lot. So, yeah, I like the community. Alright, next question by the same person. What is your favorite warrior cat? Dovewing. A lot of people don't like her because she just quote unquote popped up. Well, I just like the way she acts. She's. I, I don't know. I like Dovewing a lot. She's. She kind of reminds me a bit of me. Uh, uh, she reminds me a bit of like me, like, let's say I was her in that situation where she finally found out why there was no water in the lake. I'd be just as frustrated as she was. I think anyone would, but I would take action. You know, I mean, come on. Listen to the girl. She cat. Yeah. How many OCs do you have? Huh. I have three main OCs. Only one of them is a warrior cat. I have Karu, which I uh, Karu, which I think you guys have seen me draw twice, three times maybe. Um, I have I have ugh, what's her name? How do I forget my OC's name? I have Palette Splash, I haven't drawn her in a while, I should. Nah, yeah, Palette Splash, she, um, yeah, she's a pony, a Pegasus, actually. And then I have my main OC, <laughs> Petalfoot, or Kadu Cat. And then there are the other OCs I have, Melody, which you guys saw me draw. Um, let's see who else. There's Melody, there's Blaze Pelt, which I really need to make a speed paint for him. Blaze Pelt is actually Karu Cat's. Um. What's this? Uh, Karu Cat's mate. That's it. And let's see, who else do I have? I think those are all the OCs I have. If I think of any more, I'll just put them in the. Caption. That's what it's called. Last question. What program do you use to draw on? In my previous video, I mentioned what program I used to draw on. And where the mouse is, it says Paint Tool Sci. I use Paint Tool Sci. That is what I use. <laughs> that was a fail. Paint Tool Sci. Yeah. Oh, okay. I should make this a drawing. <laughs> Oops. Well,
All right, next question. Can yeah. morning asked by Morning Star. Can you help or teach us to draw like you? Well, I already made a tutorial video on how to draw correct anatomy of cats. But really, drawing like me, it'd be best to develop your own style. I already helped you with the oh, with the shading and anatomy of how to draw a cat. So really, there's nothing. There's not really much else I can do. I've already made tutorial, so it'd be best to watch that. Yes, it's long, but it's worthwhile. Usually, you have videos that are like 19 minutes. I did a full tutorial, and that ended up being one hour. I couldn't speed it up, so you're just going to have to be a bit patient on that video. And if you want, I might I'll put in the subscription um, what parts I'm describing, what part like let's say at maybe 10 minutes of the video I start talking about how to draw paws. I'll put that in the description so it'll help you easier. Other than that, it, just develop your own style. I mean, style is when when you create your own style, it is. I'd have to say it's based on other styles as well. My style used to look a bit like Finch Wing, like the mouth and nose and ears. I used to draw like draw those like Finch Wing. But after a while, I started to you know draw my own style. Like I do the lining like River Spirit, the mouth like river, the mouth and nose like River Spirit, and that's pretty much it. But I still have my own style. You can still tell what, which, um, what my drawings look like. If you see a drawing on Google or DeviantArt or whatever, you'll say, "Oh, that's Japanese hands." I can tell right from the bat. So yeah, just look at different tutorials and just work hard. It takes a lot of dedication and hard work to become a really good artists like Finch Wing or River Spirit and Hikarichu and Spotted Fire Spotted yeah so to answer your question I uh, wait I already answered your question but just work hard try yeah well I didn't get much done in this drawing but this video is mainly for asking or no answering questions so that's it for the day. Um, if I have more qu questions, I'll put it in another video. So, yeah. Uh, bye.